Hello friends, how are you? So today let's make a scrambled chicken masala. So it's very simple and easy to make. Uh, so you need chicken. So the first step would be to actually boil this chicken. Okay, the small pieces of chicken separately. Okay, until it turns really soft, you boil it. You can add a little bit of, uh, you know, salt and pepper when you're boiling this uh, chicken. Like, you know, you can actually pressure cook it. And then you need this uh, one whole onion and a little bit of curry leaves that I am actually, you know, frying it in a pan till the uh, onions really turn brown. You also add salt when you are actually frying these onions. And a green chili, uh, about uh, three or four pieces of green chili, you know, uh, that you have sliced, you can add. You also need one tomato and uh, this is the cooked uh, chicken that's already cooked earlier okay so i have just cooked i pressure cooked it for about uh, you know uh, for one or two whistles or if you have an instant pot maybe uh, pressure cook it for about uh, you know on a high pressure for about uh, five minutes so with the onions you also add one uh, teaspoon of uh, turmeric powder and you will also need uh, coriander powder and garam masala. So garam masala, you would require about uh, two uh, teaspoons of garam masala and about uh, um, two teaspoons of uh, coriander powder, two, and, two or two and a half teaspoons of coriander powder. And then once you have added all these uh, masalas uh, to the onions, uh, to the uh, curry leaves, if you have, and green chili, just mix them properly together so that the raw smell of these masalas vanishes. Yes, keep mixing it properly. <coughs> <coughs> Sorry. <coughs> uh, so once you have actually mixed them all together, uh, you can actually now add the uh, sliced tomato. This is one sliced uh, tomato. And then again, mix all these uh, together so that the uh, tomatoes really turn soft and tender. It might take about uh, five to six minutes. So be patient when you are mixing the tomatoes along with these masalas. Uh, once the tomatoes are really soft, then it's time to add the chicken, the scrambled chicken. It's about one pound of chicken. So these uh, masalas and the ingredients that I'm mentioning, it's for one pound of chicken. And then mix them all properly together once you've added the chicken. So just mix them together with the onions, the tomatoes, the green chili, the curry leaves. Uh, you can actually check for salt at this stage, you know. There's also black pepper that you would be adding. So... Uh, that's basically up according to your spiciness, you know. Yeah, black pepper <clears throat> would be about uh, one teaspoon or one and a half teaspoon. That's basically how spicy you want your scrambled chicken masala to be. Again, mix them all together properly for about five minutes. And... Uh, that's all guys so then once you have mixed it all properly you just need to add a little bit of uh, water maybe about uh, <coughs> uh, one fourth uh, cup of water to this and then just cover it and uh, close the lid and keep it for aside for five minutes this uh, so this process uh, you know i'm doing it on a medium flame the entire cooking that's being done right now is on a medium flame so once all this is done you just cover the lid and close the lid and keep it for five minutes and finally just add uh, you know a little bit of uh, coriander leaves or cilantro leaves on top for garnishing that's all guys enjoy this is the uh, chicken scrambled uh, masala you can have it with your rice chapati or naan anything it goes well with even with bread as a dinner or, or as a lunch also very easy to make at home and please give it a try and let me know how it goes for you guys thank you bye for now